So hi Selena. Hello. <laughs> Thanks so much for talking to us. Of course, so, thank you so much for having me. So here are some of the questions yes, that mybliss.co.uk users have sent in for you. So okay. if you'd like to choose the first question. Okay. I'm not going to look. Pick. Okay, Mrs. JLS. Hey Selena, first of all, I love you and your music. Thank you so much. If you had to do a duet with one celebrity, who would it be? I would have to say Jason Mraz because I absolutely love him and he's just very talented. Cool. Next one. Tammy Co. Have you ever regretted doing anything? No. I think that, you know, I, I've, I've made mistakes, of course, but I think that it just makes you learn and a better person, so I don't regret anything. Good. Okay. Next one. Coral XX. Hi. I was wondering what is the best thing about being famous. Um, I mean, it, it allows me to do what I love, you know, and it's given me wonderful opportunities to travel and see the world and meet my fans everywhere, so it's been, it's been very fun, it's been a blessing. Are there ever downsides to being famous? Of course, you know, there are lots of sometimes people trying to be in, you know, try to pry and get into your life and things like that, but that's okay. I mean, those, try not to focus on the negative, focus on the positive. Yeah. Okay, let's see. Kay says, hey, Sally. Are you dating Justin Bieber? <laughs> if not, would you like to date all the guys you know? Or who would I like to date out of all the guys I know? I love your work. Well, thank you very much. No, I'm not dating my good friend Justin. <laughs> I am not. And I don't know. I really wouldn't like to date anybody that I know. Because, I mean, if they're friends, I don't want to ruin a friendship. So. Yeah. No, not any of my guy friends. <laughs> what would your ideal guy be like? I think someone who's very honest. And honestly, someone who's very secure in themselves and can really just genuinely give me emotional security. Um, yeah. And someone who's just fun to be around. And what would you look like? Do you have a particular type of guy that you think? No, so I really don't. I really don't. I guess, you know, I mean, looks don't really don't matter for cool. me. I think it's just all about the person I am when oh, I'm with cool. them. Okay. <clears throat> Says from Beth. Hey, Selena, who are your celebrity crushes? I like Shia LaBeouf. I love Ryan oh, Gosling. Um, who else? I don't know. There's not too many people my age. Like, I don't know. Yeah, I think older guys. <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever met anyone famous that you've got really starstruck meeting them? Uh, well, I haven't. I've, of course, I get kind of nervous when I meet people that I respect in the industry, but as far as, like, you know, Child Buff, who I have a really big crush on. I haven't met him yet, so I'd have a heart attack if I met him. I'd probably make a fool of myself, to be honest. What would you say to him if you met him? I would say, hi, you probably know me as the crazy girl that says she likes <laughs> every interview she does, but I really love your work. <laughs> yeah, I'm it. sure he wouldn't mind. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, B. My question for Selena is, do you like Twilight? And if so, are you Team Edward or Team Jacob? That's so hard. I, I think I'm Team Jacob. But I don't know. That's a hard question. I do like Twilight. It's hard. If you could choose between being a vampire or a werewolf yourself, which would it be? Vampire. I don't know why. <laughs> They're more glamorous. Not I so hairy. I think so. <laughs> That's what it is. It's definitely. I definitely think that guys probably would choose werewolves over vampires. And girls yeah. would probably choose vampires. Definitely. Okay. Justin Bieber X. If you could do another job, what would it be? If I, you know wasn't a singer or actress, I would love to go to culinary school and learn how to be a chef. Oh, really? Yes, I'd love to learn how to cook. So what do you do? you cook for yourself at all? No, I don't. That's what I want to learn. Yeah. Because I want to be good at it. And eventually, when I get married, I want to learn how to cook for my family. Yeah. Do you even know how to boil an egg? Yes, I do. Cool. I do know the essential <laughs> things, but no, not anything well, that's else. Not bad. M4RY, you have a great sense of style. Who do you get it from? I love clothes. I love fashion. So I guess it's... Um, really just about stuff that I think is really fun. I, I don't really get too serious into it. I definitely just love simple pieces that are very classic and I love putting it together with awesome accessories like necklaces and bracelets and scarves. I kind of just mix it up. Okay, um, Danicea, do you prefer acting or singing? How did you, uh, how did you decide to create a fashion line? Yeah, I love singing and acting, but if I had to choose one, I think it would be acting, but I hope to continue to do both. And how did I decide to create a fashion line? I love, like I said before, I love style and I love fashion. So really, it was just about stuff that I wanted to do for my fans and stuff that I wanted to create. So I worked on it for about two years and I came up with the designs and how I wanted it to look. And it's very simple, very cute, flowy pieces that I would wear and hopefully my fans will wear. Lovely. Okay. 
Kashaba, would you ever consider having a friend in the UK? Yes, I think that everyone in the UK has been very nice to me, very sweet, and I would love to be friends with someone from here. Okay, Joe Jonas Girl, have you have you any tips for people who want to be in the acting and music business? You're the best, Selena. You know, I would say to make sure that you're passionate about it, make sure that you really do love it, and make sure that you don't take no for an answer, because there are a lot of people that want to bring you down. And you just have to try your hardest to surround yourself with really good people and just have fun with it. All right, this is Belle. What is the most embarrassing thing that's ever happened to you? Um, I think lots of things happen to me that's embarrassing. I forget lyrics. My, I remember I actually forgot the lyrics to Naturally on Stage one time, oh which is no. my single. And I laughed. I literally laughed. <laughs> and I was like, okay, we have to start the song over again because I was laughing so hard. Oh. Um, I don't know. I constantly trip. I am definitely tripping on myself. It's just... It's all about laughing at yourself eventually. Good for you. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you so much. Bye, guys.